So, uh, yeah, I have some challenge. It's been going for, what, two weeks now? And I thought this was going to be a fad that would come and go, and I wouldn't get nominated, I wouldn't take part, I wouldn't get to take part. Um, and then yesterday, after two weeks of nothing, just nothing, they got nominated three times in about the space of an hour. So, thanks for that, all my friends on Facebook. So I'm going to do the nomination. But before I get to that, don't back up, you're not going to get splashed, alright? <laughs> um, before I get to that, uh, I want to talk a little bit about ALS. Um, you know, the whole point of the Ice Bucket Challenge is to raise awareness. And I've seen people, friends of mine on Facebook, do the challenge, but like not talk about you know, the charity or even donating or anything like that. They just say who nominated them, don't buy some water off themselves, nominate other people, and that's it. And that's absolutely ignoring the point of the video. ALS is a ridiculously scary disease that affects the motor neurons in the brain and the spine and can shut down the body, leave, it's, it becomes paralysed and you know, kill them within a number of years. It's horrifying and there's no cure and there's no real effective treatment for it at the moment either. And that's why people are doing this because even though it affects so few people, it's still so scary and because it affects so few people, no one's raising money for it on a regular basis. Like, what's happening right now, this whole big craze of dumping ice on people and donating money, it's the only sort of attention ALS is going to get for a considerable time, if not, you know, for the rest of time. Because people are always going to focus on charities, they focus on like, you know, mental illness and cancer and stuff like that. So this is going to get nothing. So really, like, we should enjoy the spotlight that ALS is currently getting, because it's, it's a temporary thing. And it's raised, uh, if last count is correct, something like 82, 83 million dollars, which is uh, pretty insane. And so I'm going to be, you know, throwing another tenner onto that. Uh, and I'm going to nominate people at the end, and hopefully they'll donate 10 pounds as well. Uh, if you've done the challenge already and you haven't donated, and you're someone that I talked about earlier, and you're someone who just did challenge and nominate others, please consider donating retroactively. There's links in the description. To link to where you can donate. There's also a link to a video that explains ALS much more better and more effectively than mine. You might have seen it already. It's a guy who talks about it because he has it and his mum has it and uh, it's it's a very powerful video and please go watch that. Uh, but enough of me blabbing. Let's let's do what you all came to see. I know that you all came to see me done by sword or myself but because I got three nominations in an hour and because I always go by the philosophy of go hard or go home, uh, I will in fact do this. But there's not nearly as much ice as I thought, but you have to trust me that that is fully cold water that I've just dumped several bags of ice into. So I don't think that, yeah, I don't think that, like, dipping myself in would be effective. I think I've got to really just go for it. This is probably do with some more, ah, oh, bloody hell in there, don't mind. Alright, uh, go to ASLA, A-L-S-A, sorry, ALSA.org, it's in the description, and, uh, I will... <laughs> Regret this immediately. Oh, and I thanks for 7,000 subscribers as well. Just hit that yesterday. Love you all. Oh, oh my god. Oh. I nominate uh, the five people that I have in the description on the side of my channel. So that's George, uh, Sam, George, Sam, Tim, Blake, and Yao. You have, oh Jesus. Uh, you don't have 24 hours, you can do whatever you want, but when you do, please consider donating to the charity. Oh my god. Okay. 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 Uh, please go uh, check the description. Educate yourself on a ALS. It's uh, pretty scary. That was terrible. Alright. Uh. Let's feel it.